Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. So in today's video, I'm going to be talking about the stargazing bubble camp that you can stay at here in Sartell. So without further ado, let's roll the intro for today's video. But first, let me grab the intro. So right now I'm just on my way to the Burnings parking lot where I'm going to talk about the stargazing bubble camp. Alright guys, so I made it to the Burnix parking lot. So it looks like right now they're like doing some construction over here. And they're doing, there's like another event going on over here I guess. So when I first heard about this stargazing bubble camp. It looked really cool to stay at. And I was surprised, I was like, wait, there's like a Airbnb bubble camp that you can stay at here in Sartell? It's like kind of weird, but like I first found out about it in like the beginning or middle of July. So, but I never got the chance to stay there. And like I was searching last night on Airbnbs and I couldn't, like it wasn't even on the website, um, airbnb.com, like it wouldn't, like if you would search it up, like it wouldn't pop up. So I don't know if they're still letting people stay there or not, or what's going on there, but I just thought it was super cool. And it looks like really nice too, from the pictures I saw, so. The location of this stargazing bubble camp is at someone's backyard apparently. Austin and I were trying to find this place and we were kind of looking around uh, the Sartell City Hall and like around there and eventually because um, we like googled it and stuff like that and it led us to this house um, on 2nd and a half street. This is like so if you're driving down that street then it would be the last house on the right side. Well, someone's house is just right around the corner over there and we think 
the bubble camp is just right over there. It'd be cool to stay there, but like I said, I don't even know if they're letting people stay there anymore. But I just thought it was kind of cool to, to share this. I don't know if any of you guys have seen this before or have ever been there, but I don't know. I just thought it was kind of cool. I was like, what? You can stay in a bubble in Sartel? I was like, that's crazy. So I recently went on a trip with my mom, my sister, and her boyfriend to the west coast and that was really fun. So I'm currently working on the travel films and I think I'm gonna make like a Seattle travel film. It'll probably be kind of like a short one because we were only there for like like a day and a half or something like that. And then the other travel film will be Oregon and Northern California. Also, you guys probably saw my new one-wheel pint guards. They look super sick. So I got the mint ones. They look so good. Yeah, so recently, they actually came out with these not too long ago, and I was really excited to get them, because at first they didn't have them on their website, so I was like, oh, I would have gotten them when I got my one wheel, but they didn't have them then, so just kind of a new thing they came out, uh, came out with, so super excited that I got them. So I'm riding my one wheel back and it's currently at like 6% right now. So I might end up walking back and carrying my one wheel, which is gonna suck. Well, it's at 3% and it's not letting me ride it. And I just have to go like up the hill and down the hill, so it's not too far of a walk, but eh, it's whatever. And you know what? It's a great exercise. <laughs> so I don't really mind walking it all the way back to my house. But you know, kinda sucks. <laughs> That'll do it for me guys. So if you liked today's video, then be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe if you aren't already. Turn on those bell notifications so every time I post a video, you'll be notified. So that's it for me. I'll see you guys in the next one.
Peace.